Dalit's opposition leader, Raila Dinga, stands accused for applying double standards in dealing with ODM party rebels. The decision to punish legislators for the association with the government has elicited sharp criticism to the party leader who has reportedly allowed governors to commit the very crime that has seen five legislated legislators expelled from the party. As our senior political affairs reporter Chris Styro informs, the expelled MPs have indicated that they have no apologies to make. Hours after ODM's National Executive Council, which is chaired by party leader Raila Odinga, resolved to expel five legislators for associating with Kenya Kwanzaa administration and working closely with President William Ruto, the legislators did not hesitate to respond. On, on his social media page, Langata MP Felix Odiwora Elias Jalango posted a photo of him carrying a box load of evidence during the presidential petition last year. And the message read in the quote, no trial is too heavy to lift, end of quote. On his part, Kisumu Senator Professor Tomo Jinde indicated that he has no apologies to make and that he will continue working with the president. You know very well what I've done for the party myself, uh, what we've uh, done, we've been. And I'm happy that uh, it has taken a different time uh, to apologize. To apologize having met the president. There's no apology about it. I went there for development. But the expulsion of the five MPs seem to have opened a can of worms exposing the party leader and his stand on democracy. Raila is already on record allowing governors elected on an ODM ticket to work with the Kenya Kwanzaa government under the leadership of President Ruto. <laughs> On the other hand, he has been harsh and not mincing his words against ODM legislators who have decided to work with the current administration. If you want to go and see Mr. President as a person of parent status, go. But if you want to go and talk about issues that affect the party, then you must give, give him permission by the party before you go to see the president. What you see, these people must be seen for what they are, traitors in the course of a revolution. ODM governors seem to be comfortable with his plan. <laughs> The first time MP Odor bore the blunt of his close relationship with the president when he was forcefully ejected from an Azimio meeting in Manzoni and accused of being a rebel. ODM party leader John Badi has already informed those expelled that they still have an opportunity to be pardoned by the party should they show up and either apologize to the party for their rebellion or give valid reasons for their rebellion. Chris Dairo, KTN News, Nairobi. All right, more than 14 governors from 